So what is up, everybody? Do you like that feature? There's fucking nets everywhere. Do you guys like that feature on YouTube? Where you can turn off your subscriber account and what I mean by that is turning it off a lot of people are saying um, they want to turn it off because either they're embarrassed by how many subscribers they have or they don't want to show that they have a billion subscribers and me personally I think it's cool to show how many subscribers you have that's why a lot of times I look at people's YouTube channel I'm like oh this dude has 500,000 subscribers but some people are like when they look at the uh, subscriber number they look at it as they're jealous because this dude has 500,000 subscribers and the other person only has 50 subscribers they're wondering why their friend is getting hundreds of thousands of subscribers while you're getting none so at the end of the day are you guys excited that YouTube now allows you to turn off that feature or do you think YouTube should just automatically um, make it where you have to show your subscribers Cause the only way you can see some somebody subscribers if they have turned off is if you go to their YouTube channel itself their profile hit the button that says a uh, uh, about and it'll say when they started making uh, when they made their YouTube channel it'll say like they have a hundred thousand subscribers and they have like a hundred thousand channel views me personally I think that's a pretty cool thing to look at look at somebody's uh, accomplishments I at least want to show my accomplishments and say hey I got three thousand subscribers and if someone likes it cool if they don't that's cool too but like I said guys uh, I just got a little bit maybe a little time lapse of uh, this little pond area over here and um, I thought you guys would be interested in seeing it and I added to the vlog because this is only a little bit from from my house, like maybe two miles from my house, and I just rode up here. And I thought you guys would enjoy it as much as I do. It would be really nice if it wasn't hot or humid. It would be so nice to come over here if you had like a girlfriend, you your, your girl with a boyfriend, and you just sit here and you look at the uh, little fountain over there. It's a pretty relaxing uh, place. Like I said, it's a little pond, and these ponds can be relaxing if you just go and sit and chill. And right across the way is these little like high-end expensive uh, condos. But um, like I said, it's a very nice little chill spot. If you lived in one of those condos, you'd have a nice view of that little pond area. But I'm going to ride out and I will uh, talk to you guys probably a little bit later or whatever. And probably why I'm talking so loud is because I have my headphones on. And when I have my headphones on, it makes me talk a little bit louder. So I will definitely uh, see you guys in a little bit. Okie dokie. guys today's common question is where is one place you like to see and be in your town or country that is very very beautiful I showed you where I like to go a little pond area and it was really relaxing over there and right now it's pretty cool outside it's actually more uh, breezy more cool it seems like it's cooling off because it's starting to turn fall and that's a great thing because I don't like that hot humid heat that we get. So that is today's comment question. Where is one place you like to go and chill that is uh, relaxing for you guys? Let me know in the comment section below. And do you like where you live? So as always guys, remember to hit that like button, subscribe button. And I'll definitely see you guys in another video coming every Monday, every Friday. But like I said, do you guys think I upload way too much? Or do you think Monday and Friday is... Uh, alright. Bye-bye.